Joint Committee of the House of Representatives has directed the Nigerian Navy to immediately release a vessel which it had arrested on suspicion of crude oil theft. After the meeting of the Joint Committee on Petroleum Resources and the Navy with representatives of the Nigerian Navy and agents of the vessel, the House has directed the police to withdraw the charges against the crew. The committee said from its investigations the vessel had not broken any law and should therefore be released. Members of the House Committee on Petroleum Resources Upstream and Navy with representatives of the Nigerian Navy, the Nigerian Police Force and agents to the vessel MT Saint Vanessa. They met to discuss the fate of the vessel which was arrested by men of the Nigerian Navy on the 19th of June this year off the Nigerian coast. According to naval officers, following a directive from the Minister of State for Defence, the ship was handed over to men of the Nigerian Police Force a situation members of the committee frowned at. So the committee believed that based on the report we received from our naval commanders around the area, there was nothing in the ship. And since they said that the ship did not violate our international world, I mean, any laws of international waters, you know, we were even going to submit a report as a committee that, you know, uh, the, the ship should be, be released to the owners. We asked you to take an action. Say, so please, keep this vessel. We want to investigate it. We trust the Navy. So when the Committee on Navy went to investigate, we depended on the report of the Nigerian Navy. Now, instead of waiting a little while, just to, to wait a little while for us to now come up with our decision, you have taken actions to prejudice the decision of Parliament. The motion was immediately moved to have the vessel handed back to its owners. Those in support of the motion that the uh, financial vessel will be discharged, say aye. Aye. Those against it, say no. The ayes have it. The chairman also directed the police to withdraw a court case on the matter. What they are looking at, they are looking at economic crime. As at the time of the arrest, that there was no petroleum product on board. For that, we are okay. There was no petroleum product. On board. But for validity at territorial waters, we will look at it. We will re release the ship and look at the high validity at territorial waters. We will go back and put the machinery in motion to see that wherever the case is, it's been withdrawn and the, the, the directive has been complied with. The Joint Committee has directed the Navy and the police to appear before it on the 2nd of October to give the committee an update on the matter. Lanre Lassese, Channels Television News.